amphibians have been around for 200 million years. A frog. I'll get him. Hey. He's cool. But their reign on Earth may be coming to an end. An invisible biological enemy is wiping out entire species. And there's a massive infection. Stealthy and insidious, the fungus is flooding the Earth. The last hope is a Noah's Ark for amphibians. Smithsonian Institution biologist Brian Gratwick is on the front lines of the race to save frogs. So this is the amphibian rescue pod. This is li quite literally an amphibian ark in the truest sense of the word. We have lots and lots of frogs here. Rescue pods like this one are under rush construction at zoos all over the world. Never before has a conservation effort of this magnitude been attempted. If chytrid ever disappears or is cured, descendants of these frogs will be released into the wild. But one critically threatened species is missing, Adelopus certus. Brian will lead a team of biologists deep into the jungle to look for Adelopus certus. Their mission, to save a species. The Darien region is Panama's Wild West, home to drug smugglers, armed rebels, and pristine amphibian habitat. Deep in the misty jungle looms their destination, the mountain Cerro Sapo, Toad Hill in English. They've got a tough trek ahead and a difficult mission. Their quarry, creatures no bigger than golf balls, are hiding somewhere in the vast jungles. I'm searching for a needle in a haystack. When and if they find them, Will Kittred have gotten there first? 